And look, we are playing Pizzeria Simulator. Yeah. <laughs> Which one am I doing? Uh, do you want to des design your pizza? <laughs> Sausage. Don't want onion? No, I've got onions on there. Oh. I've got everything on there. <laughs> Wait, is that sound for you? Uh, yeah. Oh, not for me. Oh. No, that's fine. This, uh, uh, we had enough trouble. I do like the music, but it's kind of fun. Hmm. Need the pizza, you fat bugs. Oi, 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 get out of here. You're not welcome. I'm the only crazy fat bug. Hey, go off. Shadow Freddy is blocking you. How the fuck am I supposed to get rid of the fat fuck? Just have to time ah. it. No, I can stop it. What? <laughs> get out of my way, you fat fuck. How many pizzas are these kids eating? A lot, because they're fat, diabetic bitches. These are entire pizzas. Okay, let's get you down here, shall we? Have your fucking feast and leave the rest of this kid. Are you fucking kidding me? What is this, my mouse? What the fuck? Told you. I might, my eyes and ears are being raped. This was the surprise! Did my game just crash? Nope. What in the fuck am I watching? I swear to god, there's a jump scare in the way. Don't you laugh? There better not- wait. I don't- You have to press that button on the tape recorder thing. Begin tape. Leaving dead space. Three. Can you, can you hear anything? Two. Yeah. One. <laughs> the purpose of this tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every oh, shift, as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations under paragraph 4. Follow these instructions, document response times, then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. Begin audio prompt in 3, 2, 1. Document results. Your ears are bleeding. Begin yeah, audio no, prompt in three, two, oh, no. one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Oh, do I see the, if the audio is in her office? No, 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 it's results. just explaining what's happening. No, it's giving. It's giving Begin audio sound. prompt in three. It's doing anything to it. Two. Oh. One. No, why? You... So she took gold. over. Yes, yeah, she did. She... <laughs> oh, fuck it's me. a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. <laughs> You've so saved money your field. whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. 
a gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right, restaurant ownership and management, something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it, and that means it's safe and lucrative. But with your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Sir, Use it sir, to decorate, whole buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and you much, the, much more. Now, let's game, take yeah. a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment You're franchisee, such as atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential <laughs> to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Bonus revenue. Coin-operated games and attractions can generate additional revenue during the day, <laughs> which means more money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. Reduce and that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that oh, buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you just oh, purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Of course, that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside <laughs> that's been trying to get in for months now, uh, which we are yeah, not confirming yeah, to be the case. This concludes the amount of that help we are legally okay. obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the so newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride and let's make some money. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. Of course it's not. Why would it be responsible for disappearance, death, or fucking... What, what am I doing now? You're making your own pizzeria. Do I buy it? No, it's not letting me buy it. I'm just going to click I'm ready. I don't want to. Loud. Holy Let's loud. see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great. That should be more than enough. Now $100. let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. Discount when you're finished bullpen. shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to open your restaurant for <laughs> your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome! Oh, that doesn't God. mean your job is finished, however. Not you have why? a lot of work to do why? while patrons a, a eat their pizza event. in the other room. From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list, you can log off for the day and get out of there. Money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash, so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket. We've got you covered. The only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Now, onto other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud and may prevent <laughs> you from hearing things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem Wait, if there is nothing clown? in the vents. Sorry, However, if you feel that something might be in the one. vents, you have a yeah. few tools at your disposal that to protect idea. yourself. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any Wait, time on the to decrease nose. the amount of attention you are drawing to yourself. Also, oh. shining your light directly into <laughs> a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. There's no light. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an audio decoy, and a secondary ventilation unit. Keep in mind, however, that you can only have one of these active at any given time. Now get to it. 
Simply yeah, log so off when you've completed it, your tasks for the day, and you can go get some coffee. Oh, so that shows you where the motion is. That shows you where they are. Hurry up. Why did my light just get darker? Hurry up! <laughs> oh, come on! Pretty sure you just have to get get on with your tasks. I don't have any more tasks. Oh, the night ends when you finish all of your tasks. Yep. Is there like spooky ambience? No, it's just just fan. <laughs> and that giant gaping vent. Oh, this game is so loud, I can't hear a goddamn thing. Is is there volume settings or anything? Nope. Pretty sure the more you buy animatronics, the more they appear. Wait, you're saying I have to do this more than once? Yeah, that's the whole point of the game. The, like, let's say if you buy, let's say you buy Foxy, like, to get more money. Oh, wait, I don't have any. Yeah, you don't. Then why but, the fuck was I scanning between the two? The jump scare So yeah, they'll get you more money, but they're also something else you have to face at night. Right. It's a flickering lot. Great job. It okay, looks before I do anything, I'm gonna quickly turn you over. Oh, I forgot I can't. Thing you through your first week. There's a big party here Saturday, and you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. How long does this game last for? Do you know? Congratulations um, on completing your hours? first day. You're kidding. However, your job isn't over just yet. How exactly does a three there is another aspect to your end of day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Well, Things are found here quite often, and while we aren't sure goals. why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts which can mean a much needed revenue boost Jai, before starting Jai, your next Jai, day. Jai, the more you of course, the paper up, the as more with everything else in this forward. line of work, those benefits come with risk. I'm sorry, the that's safest that's thing to do is to throw it back outside, the up, the more but then it leans forward you get and no it money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative... Sorry, what? I don't want to know that. ...of consequences, so that namely that. death. Should the item in question not be as docile as it first appeared? Yeah. Okay, if you do to decide to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. 
If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. Hello? Or, if you choose to, you can throw it back Hello? into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Throw it back into the alley. Uh, you have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Oh, fuck me! I shouldn't have pressed control there. I shouldn't have. Remember, use your company-issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Well, fuck. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Oh, no. Oh! Oh, it's, it's more forward. Ready, use the taser. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Wait, is that more forward or back? Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, oh. one. Where can I get another one off before it does Um, I'm gonna take a chance. Well, I don't have any closer. You don't? Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Oh. Document results. Okay. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. I'm just going to have to You have to mark whether it's a yes, no, or you're not sure. Hey, hey. You're, you're having to listen to what he's saying. Well, he's not saying anything. He's not. Document results. You have completed the maintenance checklist oh, oh, and may you. proceed with the salvage. <laughs> well done. End tape. You're done, aren't you? Yep. Yeah, you are. Thanks for letting me join the party. Why? We try not to disappoint. Thanks for letting me join the party. I'll try not to disappoint. Is what you just said. Wow. <laughs> you lost it. <laughs> Dump the dive me. If you failed and he jump scared you, he'll be loose in the pizzeria and you'd have to face him at night. No, now you just get the money. Do I have to buy all the stuff I do? Uh, you don't have to, but they have mini games in them which make the game longer. What? What the fuck? I didn't want to make the game longer. No, it's not. No, they're like optional stuff. Well, you, you've completed the first night. You should probably end the episode here.